Hi, John Haver here, and this is how to analyze backlinks before purchasing a website, and this is part one, anchor text. So this is what we look for, uh, me and my team, when we're purchasing uh, either a website or an expired domain, uh, what we're looking for to determine if it's an unnatural uh, anchor text profile in the background that we want to make sure that we're not buying a website that will potentially be subject to a Google penalty. So we'll use Majestic SEO here to look at a couple examples. So the first example here is nature's uh, gold specialties .ca, and so it's pretty obvious that at 95% there's no question that this has been clearly manipulated to get an anchor text density that high. So we'll look at a slightly less obvious example as well. So you can also see the density here, but we'll get into that discussion later in part two. Um, so right now we're just looking at this anchor text area, which is a pretty quick check on um, if a site has been manipulated or not. With almost a thousand backlinks from closing in on 50 different sites and domains there, that we have um, only three different anchor texts used, and that they're at basically 50%, 50%, 1%. So that is clearly not a natural um, anchor text profile. Um, and then so that's. Kind of the, the anchor text density is one thing to make sure th that uh, we're aware of. The other one is um, obvious spam in the anchor text. So that's uh, obvious spam in this location. So that looks fine, but we'll look at another example here. So this one, it doesn't appear quite as obvious right away because it does look almost natural classic purse and then you've got bags but when everything is a replica DNG bag wholesale DNG bag at that high concentration everything is using replica it's it, you can tell that it has been manipulated what we're looking for here with um, obvious spam in the anger text words is if we see anything that the, the obvious giveaway is if there's anything Porn, poker, pharmaceutical, foreign language, or completely unrelated. So if there was something for payday loans in here, then that would be pretty obvious that it wouldn't go with this site. So this is a less obvious um, spammed anchor text, but nonetheless it is. it has been manipulated, and we want to try and avoid um, anything that appears to be overly manipulated. So that's what we're looking for. Again, to recap... The, um, concentration of anchor text. So this looks like an okay split, but then we're looking at what the actual anchor text is itself. And if it looks like it's been heavily um, chosen by the person building links to it, then we want to avoid that as well. And then we want to make sure that there's no porn, poker, pharmaceutical, foreign language, or unrelated to um, classic purse in this area. Um, so that's it for part one, and I'll see you in the next video for part two.